Hey everybody, today is December 2nd and I have an update on these plants that I've been testing. Uh, the one on the left is the chocolate scotch bonnet uh, that I have been adding um, hydroponic nutrients to and the one on the right is just regular water. And as you can see, after two weeks the plant is consistently larger, the one with hydroponic. So anytime you feed it hydroponic nutrients, the plants soak it up very very fast. And so I, I usually add it every two days and it seems to be helping the plants grow really well. Look at the size difference. Might have to top these very soon so that they can wait for the rest of them to grow. So I've added a few varieties to my collection this year. And here's what I have. And last two weeks uh, we started the uh, MOA Scotch Bonnet and check this out one of it has sprouted so the other one should be on its way and started on the 16th and I've added more to my collection here so I'll, I'll, I'll list what I have uh, here is the Trinidad Scorpion Cardi I have here the Peach Congo and Orange Ricardo Mini Ricardo and here's uh, one, the one that I grow every year, the Carolina Reaper. Uh, it didn't do too well for me last year, so I decided to grow it again. Uh, Red Habanero, these are great, very prolific plants, really, really good um, to use as dry peppers. And the last three I have here was given to me by one of a friend on YouTube, and uh, his name is The Cable Guy. So I'll, I'll give you links to his his channel. He has he has a ton of good um, peppers last year that he grew. They they look fantastic. And this is the seven pot infinity. And my last one here is caramel boots. So those are all I have this year. Uh, I just started them today. Same method as I did with the Scotch bonnet. Use, using a ziplock bag on top, uh, these really provide really good heat for plants, so they they go very quickly. But anyway, that's all I have for today. So I'll keep you guys updated.